This is taking longer than expected. Hello! Just kidding. We prepare for everything. Everything. Really? Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Unit No Jack. My name is WWD Devman, but you already know that. Binge Pipe continues to stick with its commitment to present You Don't Know Jack. Binge Pipe. We keep saying it's good. Yeah. And I keep on not believing you. Hello, I'm Cookie Masterson, and just like this game, I've been aged to perfection. You're playing by yourself so you can relax. Nobody will know what happens except me and you and whoever I tell and also whoever you tell. Also, whoever watches this video. And we're off. Time for question one. Let's start with Beware of gamers <coughs> wearing gifts. Which of these would be a level from Super Mario Odyssey if it mirrored the story of Homer's Odyssey? Should be easy. Level 2, Riddle of the Yoshi. Level 5, Angry Goombas on River Styx. Level 8, Kart Racing in the Coliseum. Or Final Battle, Mario vs. Peach's Suitors. I love this part. This is the fifth level in Dante's Inferno where all those who rage quit video games are doomed to spend eternity. <coughs> what are you thinking this one? Homer's Odyssey ends with the hero defeating all the men who tried to marry his beloved. Really? He probably th jumped on their heads or something. <laughs> That's the part of the story nobody ever talks about. Because it's uninteresting. I call this one great moments in sports. That was like the, the first, first golf, uh, moon. story. Because clubs can't handle me, Aldrin, Neil, Bernie, that had a shit Armstrong, ending and nobody Edgar talking. Nobody was talking about. Mitchell, uh, Alan PGA, what? Shepherd. First man to. Uh. Aldrin? So what'd you pick? The game wouldn't be fun if you got everything right. No? Here's what you meant to pick. Apollo 14 astronaut Alan Shepard was the first man to play golf on the moon. Not to be confused with the Monstars, of course. The first cartoon aliens to ball on Earth. Why do we do it with green? Try this on for size. Running a sparkling clean campaign. And oh joy, it's a dis or dat. Great. I'm going to read seven names, and for each, I want you to tell me if it's a political action committee, you know, the kind that privately raise money to influence elections, or part of the name of a detergent packet for laundry or dishes, you know, like Tide Pods. Answer quick, you'll only have a few seconds to choose between a political action committee or a detergent pod. Ready? Let's go. Parkland Values Pack. I have no idea. Vivid White Bright Pack. Three in One Power Pack. Pride Pack. Three T Pack. Platinum Action Pack. Almighty Pack. You really excel in the middle lane. Okay, let's move along. I don't need you anymore. This one's called In Development. What was Kumail Nanjiani's first role? An embryo, a zygote, a fetus, or a phalanx? Uh. And how do we do? The zygote is formed as soon as a sperm fertilizes an egg, and it's the earliest role Kumail, as well as all humans, held on this list. <laughs> to be fair, it was a pretty small role, but he did beat out millions of applicants for the part. <laughs> Up next, a little science. How would a little bee react with litmus paper? 
The based god would turn litmus paper blue. The based god would turn litmus paper red. The based god would turn litmus paper white. Or the based god would dissolve the litmus paper. Okay, what'd you pick? A base will turn a strip of litmus paper blue. Duh. Litmus paper will also turn you blue if you wrap enough of it tightly around your face. It, That's it, it, round one. I'm pretty sure the litmus paper would rip. Doubled in round two. It's not okay, that sturdy. And now, Homer delivery. If Amazon had been responsible for getting Odysseus home to his wife after the Trojan War, which of these status updates would she not have read? Ordered, package is currently showing hubris, it's on the way, package making love to a goddess, delayed, package escaping from Mount Olympus, or delivered, package on your doorstep, you don't recognize him. Okay, let's take a look. Odysseus went through a lot on his journey, but he never visited Mount Olympus. Yeah, that would be completely out of the way. My colleagues in the Creta said. It's time for death, the ultimate unlimited data plan. Personally, I'm fine with it. Actors gotta eat. But my mother is very upset with the Verizon guy who is doing those sprint commercials now. Who? According to Dante's Inferno, if the Verizon guy went to the part of hell reserved for the greatest traitors, how would he spend eternity oh, great. frozen on a FaceTime call in the ninth circle, dropping calls in the eleventh circle, searching for bars in the third circle, or being ghosted by real ghosts in the fifth circle? Um, traitors. Third circle? Hope you like what you picked. What a pity. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? No. Dante wrote that the worst traitors of history, including Judas, were frozen in the ninth circle of hell. No idea. Hey, question. We'd like to initiate a moment of playful interactivity. Would you like a question about mom or a question about dad? Pick your poison. It's literally irrelevant. Let's see what it does if I don't choose. Never tried that. You refuse to participate. How sad. Binge Pipe will select the slightly less satisfying option. Twas then uh. I learned to heed the winds of air. How about this one? A question about dad. What dad joke would follow the opening line of Moby Dick? Hi Ahab, I'm dad. Hi Ishmael, I'm dad. Hi Queequeg, I'm dad. Or hi Starbuck, I'm dad. Let's see how that shook out. You won't like this, unless you're into failure. Fuck I if I know. I really wanted you to pick this one. The first line of Moby Dick is, call me Ishmael. And you can call me a guy who didn't get past page one. And you can't call me a guy who never even saw page one of Moby Dick. There is no hiding from... Can I get those digits? Some people prefer online shopping to retail, but I've never had to remember a password to get into JCPenney. What could you order from Amazon Prime if they only shipped quantities that were prime numbers? 33 prime rib steaks, 45 buckets of paint primer, 49 Optimus Prime action figures, or 53 Primus CDs. 53. I love this part. 53 is the only number on the list that's a prime number, which is a number that can only be divided by one and itself. Unlike my love of Primus, which can never be divided by anything, Mom. Here we have your corporate family. Ugh, they don't pay me enough to read this stuff. Binge Pipe recommends. Because you earn money working as a paper boy, we recommend taking a trip to Atlanta, Broad City, Twin Peaks, or Jersey Shore. I have got the slightest. And how'd we do?
This what you had in mind? Earn and Paperboy are characters in the FX TV show Atlanta. Never even heard of it. It's time for the attack. When you see an answer that matches the category. Oh, I'm sorry, I was hosting a game. How stupid of me. Here's yeah. Your clue. Traditionally in it. I'll show you an ingredient. You tell me which dishes traditionally contain it. Bon Potato. I have no idea. Shepherd spy does. British lasagna. Poutine does. What the for fake for what the fuck are lapkeys? Tomato. Uh, I don't know any of these. Apart from the ones that I know aren't containing tomato. Sashimi. Oh wait, no, that's without rice. Saki is a rice wine. Or Paella is rice. What? Tartar. Um, Garbacho. Uh, I mean, that's. It doesn't. Good. Whiskey. Uh, in an old fashioned. In an Irish coffee. And in a Manhattan. in this game and in my heart still you did the bare minimum of what was asked of you which is impressive considering you don't know jack yep i will see you in the next one until then leave a like if you enjoyed subscribe for more and until next time i'm the wwe deadman bye